here. Where were you? Your 20th century poets class ended two hours ago. Hey, Roy. Hey, Doyle. I was just dropping Logan off at the airport. Oh, yeah, yes, I'm meeting the same friend. When is it? Tomorrow afternoon. Wish him luck for me. I will. Seriously? You're gonna stand here making idle chit chat on the single most important day of my life? Sorry, sweetie. Paris has some news. Not some news, the news. Responses from Harvard Medical School, Johns Hopkins School of Medicine, Penn Medical, oh, yeah. Yale Law School, Stanford Law School, and Columbia Medical. And before you comment on envelope thickness, keep in mind that so much stuff is online these days, thickness is no longer an accurate indicator. Hmm. I knew you would want to be here when I open them. Yeah, right, thanks. Go on, run, do it. <sighs> okay. My lucky letter opener. Mm -hmm. Used it to open the envelope conveying my acceptance to Yale four years ago. And don't look at me like I'm some kind of superstitious freak. It's just a precautionary device. If it works, great. If not, I needed to open the letters anyway. I don't know which to open first. Choose one. Okay. Um, Yale Law School. Yeah, Law School. Okay. Wow. That's a great school. I'd be lucky to get in there, you know? You open it. Me? You're lucky. I am? How else do you explain the fact that you got into Harvard four years ago and I didn't? All right, luck. Okay. Use a letter opener. Oh, are you sure the letter opener's luck isn't going to cancel out my luck? I don't know. Is that how it works? I was kidding. Sorry. Here we go. All right. Dear Paris Geller, we are pleased to inform you. <laughs> to me, Rory Gilmore. Aww. I mean, the way you cut your ruthless path to the head of the Yale Daily News and never looked back, I never told you, but I really admired that. Thanks. <laughs> and, Doyle, I know this process didn't exactly bring out my soft and fuzzy side. It doesn't matter. I love you, baby. And I am so proud of you. I love you, too. <laughs> I just can't believe that I got into the second best law school in the country. <laughs> it's such an honor. It doesn't matter, really, if I get into the others. I have a great option right here. You do. Yeah. Anyway, go ahead. Might as well open Harvard, even though it doesn't matter. Use letter opener again. Okay. Okay. We are pleased to... the same way they rejected me that dark day four years ago. Who's laughing now? Okay, um, so next we have, what, University of Pennsylvania? All right, let's see what it says. <laughs> we are pleased to hear yeah, I mean, yeah. <laughs> What's that about? Hmm? You're a noticeable drop off in enthusiasm. Is that a reflection of the fact that you're less impressed by my admission to the University of Pennsylvania School of Medicine than you were by my other acceptances? But I'd say we're just as impressed, wouldn't you, Doyle? Oh, absolutely. Because it's a preeminent institution in the interrelated disciplines of patient care, education, and research. It's a great school. Mm -hmm. Top notch. Fine, you've made your point. Perception should play a role in my decision-making process. Well, I guess that's what Doyle and I were saying. I mean, let's face it. You say Harvard Medical School and people are automatically impressed. And that counts for something. That's true. So, you think I should go there? Oh, well, that's not what I'm saying. I mean, or that you shouldn't. I'm just, what I'm saying is that you have all these great options. Yeah, I know. So, how do I decide? Oh, you'll figure it out, huh? How? This is a huge decision. The biggest decision I've had to make in my life. Law school or med school. I have two passions, and obviously I'm vastly talented in both fields. What news do I follow? Not to mention location-wise, where do I want to live for the next three or up to eight years? Open the others. Yeah? Okay. Columbia. Mm -hmm. It's also a good school. Mm -hmm. We are pleased. Oh, Ooh. God! Paris, you're just being silly, okay? It's good to have options. Yeah, right. You can say that because there's only one thing you want. Talk to me if you don't get the New York Times Fellowship and you have to choose between six other papers. I'm sorry. I just meant it, it must be nice to know what you want. Yeah, well, nice, yeah, that's one way to put it. And scary is another. You have a great shot at the rest of it. Are you dealing with A.J. Abrams writing that rec? Well, I'm sure all the candidates have great recommendations. The New York Times would be lucky to have you. Thanks. 
Well, I'll find out soon enough. But come on, this is your moment. Should we open another one? All right. Hey, hey, you got in a stand? Enough with the hysterics. I have a big decision to make, and all this hooting and hollering isn't exactly helping matters.